Today I am talking about the Thursday Boot Company Summit Flannel and more specifically this is the Timberwolf colorway. Not too long ago I did a video on the Thursday Forever Flannel which is holding up really well. Really love wearing that one. I have a full video on it and I'll put a link at the end of the video in case you want to check it out. Uh, but the Forever Flannel is a 6 ounce fabric so it's on the lighter side and I had somebody ask if I had tried the 10 ounce Summit flannel, which I didn't even realize was heavier than the Forever flannel. I just assumed all of the new flannels were the same weight. So thanks a million to the viewer that pointed that out for me. Really glad you did. It was tough to pick a shirt because all of the color options that they've got are super nice, really versatile. I could see myself wearing any of them. Um, but I ended up going with the Timberwolf because I don't have another flannel that's close to these tones. So I figured that'd be the best bet. As mentioned, the Summit flannel is a nice 10 ounce weight. There are heavier flannels out there, but this still feels nice and substantial. It's made from 100% organic cotton uh, and it's been brushed, which will make it a little softer, a little more comfortable from the get-go. And it's also pre-washed, which again, will make it softer, a little more comfortable from the get-go. Uh, but the benefit that I like of the pre-washed fabric is that you're not gonna have any shrinkage issues, which I have washed my Forever flannel and didn't have any shrinkage issues with that at all. I machine washed it on cold uh, and then hung it to dry and I, just, I noticed as I was doing this right up here that the care suggestion for the Summit flannel is to machine wash cold, hang it to dry, so uh, I got lucky on that one. I really like the length. I usually wear my shirts untucked um, and this length works great for that, but it would also work if I wanted to tuck it in too or if you tuck your shirt in, the length would work well for that. The stitching's all well done, the buttons are on solid, I haven't found any issues there. Uh, one thing that I did mention in my video about the Forever flannel, uh, and it's the same for the Summit flannel, is that the bias on the seams aren't quite lined up. It's a small little detail, and I'm guessing, because this is their first run of shirts, that as they produce more, they'll start to look at some of those things they can fine tune, and that'll probably be uh, one of the things that they look at. Uh, and that would really honestly take this shirt to the next level um, or even looking at, uh, you know, kind of having a, a bias cut shirt where you they could work on, on some of the angular patterns. Anyways, small detail, but for the price, which surprisingly is only 98 bucks, you're getting one hell of a shirt. I expected this one to be a little bit more than the Forever Flannel because you've got the beefier fabric. You could even wear it as an overshirt. Um, I've got some pictures in here where I've just got it unbuttoned over a t-shirt, but it's the same price for the Summit flannel as it is for the Forever flannel. So yeah, 98 bucks, I think that's a really great price. The fit is a nice balance between kind of a comfortable relaxed fit and a, and a classic straight um, silhouette. I like my shirts to fit roomy, so I went with a large knowing that it would have the space that I like. I'm 6'1" around 180 pounds. I've got a 42 inch chest. And again, I went with a large, so this is what a large looks like on me. If I was looking for more of a slim fit or if I was gonna be tucking my shirt in, I would have gone with a medium. But this is exactly how I hoped it would fit. I would say just order your usual size and you'll be good to go. I always order a large in shirts for the most part and uh, you know this fits like a typical large would. So that is the Thursday Boot Company Summit Flannel. It's got a great fit. I really like this heavier option coming in at 10 ounces. If you've got any questions, feel free to put them in the comments and I'll do my best to answer. Also, as promised, here is a link up in the corner if you wanna see the full video on the six ounce Forever Flannel. Thank you so much for watching the video.